Good day. My name is Lakshbel, and I want to quickly talk to you about why you should participate in the Sell Token Short Squeeze, even if you're not a Celsius depositor. But of course, especially if you are a Celsius depositor. Uh, so let's get started. Well, the first thing I want to talk about is how I make my decisions with respect to everything in life. And uh, one of the things or one of the forces that I need for me to be catalyzed into action about anything at all is to have at least two, maybe three different reasons to do something. So if I wanted to go to New York, I would have to have three different reasons for me to go to New York. If I wanted to go travel across Africa, I would need at least three different reasons and travel alone is just one reason. So I wouldn't go to Africa just for the sake of travel alone until and unless I could find at least one more, uh, hopefully two more reasons, two additional reasons to go to Africa uh, other than just travel. So that's how I make my decision. Uh, if I want to upgrade a laptop, again, it's got to be, you know, at least three different reasons for me to be able to do that. Uh, if you want to, if I want to move from one house to another, I have to have three different reasons to do that. And so I want to give you three reasons why you should participate in the sell token short squeeze if you are a Celsian and especially or even if you're not a Celsian already. So let's get started. Well, the first thing, first reason is, of course, money. Okay. So this is where risk management comes into play. How much do you bet? Definitely not all the money you've got. <laughs> Definitely. This is not financial advice. But, uh, but I, can, I can tell you that I never bet all of my money on anything at all. So you don't want to bet all your money on anything at all. You want to bet a small portion of your portfolio, something that you're comfortable losing because this is a high risk, high reward kind of scenario. Okay, the best case scenario is that if you buy sell token at $1 and you invest $100 in it, well, if sell token goes to $100, you walk away with 10K. Okay, that's the best case scenario. It could be even better than that if your selling price is higher or your buying price is lower than $1. If your selling price is higher than one hundred dollars, but that's the that's the thing you want to get in because this is a short squeeze. It has already begun. You can already see it trending on Twitter. You can already see that the price of sell token has jumped up by six hundred percent in one week already, and we are not going to stop. We are going to drain all the liquidity out of the exchanges, centralized as well as decentralized, put it all into our own wallets. Because remember, most of the sell token is locked up into the Celsius network itself. And that's not available for sale at all. So the only way anybody can buy sell token is off the exchanges right now. But once the exchanges don't have any more liquid sell token supply, well, you can guess what happens to the price, especially if we, the holders, hold the line and place limit orders to sell the sell token at $100 or beyond. They don't have a choice. So all the math is adding up to the possibility of a sell token squeeze, a sell token short squeeze. And uh, so, yeah, you can, you can, you stand to make a lot of money with this. And that's why you should get in on this. Personally, to me, though, money is not the biggest motivator. I talked about this in a Twitter Spaces event I was talking at uh, a couple of days ago. For me, the biggest thing is it's the freedom from manipulation. Okay, that's the big thing that motivates me. Markets, currently what we have is not pure capitalism. What we have is crony capitalism, cronyism. And so we saw that with GameStop short squeeze, people got greedy, you know, hedge funds got greedy, and they shorted more than 100% of the entire available supply of GameStop. People started realizing that, retail people, people like you and me, and everybody started chipping in, and what they had was a short squeeze. Now, it did happen, but there was manipulation, okay? Uh, Robinhood, which is a brokerage, they said you cannot have more than one or you cannot buy more than one stock of GameStop if you're retail, basically. <laughs> and so they prevented the short squeeze from happening. And that is why I keep recommending move your sell tokens off the exchanges. Don't let anyone else pull that same IOU shenanigans or uh, rehypothecation shenanigans or limited, uh, you know, uh, limited transactions uh, shenanigans against you. So I don't want someone else coming in, and this is a matter of ethics and morality for me, not necessarily uh, a matter of legality, because what they're doing is perfectly legal, the short sellers. So what they're doing is engaging in legalized thievery. 
they saw that celsius network as a company as a community celsians were under a lot of stress especially when the withdrawals were halted temporarily last week and so they, so they sought to capitalize on it and they shorted the sell token down hoping to buy it back at 1 cents which is close to 0 cents just to make a quick million dollars out of it or 2 million or 5 million or uh, if my estimates are correct um close to uh, 10 or 20 million dollars out of it anyway uh, altogether maybe even more though i don't know the exact price and nobody knows the exact price at which the shorting uh, started but this happened so they thought they could liquidate celsius network they could have us lose all our deposits and i have some serious deposits on celsius network it's not what it used to be last year but it's nothing to sneeze at and i know several people my family members my friends they have trusted me they have trusted my advice gone on to place their deposits on celsius network uh, their cryptocurrency deposits on celsius network and these guys just think that just because it's legal they can come in here and spread all these fear uncertainty and doubt think they think that we they can make us all believe that celsius network is now insolvent which is absolutely not true or at least it does not seem to be true at this point of time to me um and then make us lose all our deposits by just crashing the cell token which basically crashes their treasury celsius network's treasury which is the single largest holder of cell token in the world so i don't want this manipulation i am not going to stand for this manipulation of market i'm not going to stand uh, for someone else coming in and taking away the deposits of or destroying the deposits of hundreds of thousands of depositors who want the best case scenario for the crypto market who are actually risking their own money for this freedom you know why do we get into crypto it's freedom freedom from manipulation freedom from inflation free, freedom from hyperinflation and uh, freedom from people just stealing our wealth and yeah these guys think that none of that matters and they can manipulate the market i am not going to stand for it and from the looks of it thousands upon thousands of celsians are not going to stand for it so that's the second reason to join in you're joining in for a cause it's not just money you're joining in for a cause and you should absolutely do that and the third reason of course is getting your deposits back <laughs> this applies more to celsians but it also applies to the crypto market as a whole and i'll explain why if you are a celsian your deposits are held by the celsius network celsius network has a treasury which has at this point of time 340 million cell tokens okay this treasury is on their balance sheet on celsius's balance sheets so if the cell token crashes to zero the value of the treasury goes down to zero as well if that happens celsius is going to have a lot greater fight they're going to have to fight a lot harder in order to be able to avoid capitulation or going insolvent on the other hand if it goes to 100 dollars if the cell token goes to 100 dollars this becomes worth 35 billion dollars just the treasury alone and it's one of the many assets that uh, celsius network has in which case do you think it is easier for the celsius network to be able to get back to normalcy basically to a normal state of withdrawals and deposits and getting back to business as usual with a 35 billion dollar treasury or a zero dollar treasury and if you're not a celsian you may think that this does not affect you but remember celsius is big enough that if celsius network collapses the entire crypto market is going to collapse with it bitcoin might as well go down below $10000 that is a real possibility ethereum might go down below 500 bucks that's a possibility so it does affect you even if you're not a celsian these are the three reasons why you should be participating in the shell token short squeeze personally for me this is the greatest reason okay uh, freedom from manipulation i'm not going to stand for people the same old people uh, who have been manipulating markets for decades now close to a century now getting in here and then starting to manipulate the crypto market that's just not why crypto was invented that's not why uh, satoshi nakamoto invented bitcoin or the protocol or trustless finance blockchain was invented to fight against this and just because we have a risky situation right now does not mean we should throw in the towel and that's the biggest reason for me to fight of course i like the money as well if sell token goes to 100 bucks and i sell it at 100 bucks even if not all of what i'm holding just a portion of what i hold it's great you know 
But um, yeah, I mean, take one of those three reasons, maybe two of those three reasons. But for me, all three of those reasons are significant enough that I am going to continue to participate in this shell, sell token short squeeze. And I'm going to continue to talk about it until we get to $100, until we wreck those market sell, manip manipulators, the short sellers, uh, and hang them by the nose that they prepared for us. That's it from me. That's this video. My name is Laksh Bell. Subscribe if you want more videos like this. I'm going to continue to talk about, uh, well, for now, the sell token short squeeze, but also personal productivity and personal finance and how not to get into super risky situations. And uh, yeah, uh, go ahead and subscribe. And if you haven't already seen my previous videos on the sell token short squeeze, you can find them in the description below. Have a great day.